Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to cancel your Microsoft Game Pass subscription. Whether it's the ultimate version or the standard version, we're going to show you how to cancel the recurring payment on this. So what I'm going to do is leave a link in the description for the Microsoft website, and uh, we're going to go ahead and sign in to our Microsoft account. So type in the email address and password for the Microsoft account that you've used to actually subscribe to Microsoft Game Pass. And here we're going to be signing into our accounts. So I'm actually signed in right now. And what we're going to do is click on our account here and then go to my Microsoft Microsoft account. So this is going to open up a new tab. So once we've opened up our account page, we're going to click on services and subscriptions on this left sidebar here. That's going to show us everything that we're subscribed to via Microsoft. So I have my Microsoft 365 family account here, and I also have Microsoft Game Pass Ultimate. And here is where we want to make our change. So we're going to click on manage here. So here we have two options here. We can turn off recurring billing, which basically means that we stop making a payment after the subscription ends. We can also click on cancel subscription here. So you don't really want to cancel your Xbox Game Pass if you want to keep making use of this subscription service. So I don't really recommend doing this, especially if you have remaining time on your subscription. So it's better just to turn off recurring billing. And here it's saying, do you want to cancel Xbox Game Pass? So what I'm going to do is scroll down and I'm going to click turn off recurring billing. And it says here, goodbye for now. Our recurring billing has been canceled. So this is effectively canceling our Xbox Game Pass. So if I go back to subscriptions, you'll see that this is basically turned off and I can still make use of Xbox Game Pass until my next billing period. So this is until August 24th. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.